along with data uh, expansion and explosion uh, comes the natural challenges of where it's being stored uh, and where it is being retained, right? So very clearly with the multi-cloud strategy that's being put up by most of our clients, the data is fragmented. And while there's a large volume of data, it's equally complex in the way they are stored and retrieved and, and fragmented across. And with COVID, with remote working, uh, we are seeing a big spike in ransomware events. Um, I'm sure all of us are following the news, especially for healthcare, manufacturing, and critical network infrastructure of the governments and public entities being attacked for ransomware and, and being held at ransom for uh, for business continuity, right? So I think uh, the data explosion, fragmentation of data naturally has led to enough opportunities for uh, being exposing this data to ransomware attacks. Uh, and, and things around that. Uh, the FBI reports that last year in 2020, 4.1 billion was paid out in ransomware fines. I mean, that's incredible. And you know what happens is every time a company pays a ransom, what it does is it funds these groups to hire more people and to do more. Cause it's like, you're basically investing in their business. So, uh, I mean, this is, this is obviously something that we're, that is not going away. And the attacks are getting more and more sophisticated cause they're getting more funding, obviously. So there's multiple ways. So protecting yourself is key, but also being able to recover uh, quickly is, uh, is key. This is where we've seen a lot of challenges with some of the legacy solutions and infrastructure out there because they were built for data being within your four walls and not in this new landscape. And then we start looking at some of the regulatory uh, and compliance, uh, compliance uh, regulations out there, be able to make sure that you're not only protecting your data, that you're managing it, that you can find it, and that you can meet all the different regulatory requirements from country to country. Uh, I mean, there's, there's so much complexity. So what can you do? Like, how can you recover? I think this is where the partnership with Wipro and Coesity really does bring value to customers. Four years ago, actually, we came up with a report called the State of the Cybersecurity Report 2018, uh, when one of our first reports that we came to the market, identifying the needs of information security and data protection and data management as a data point that we captured from 200 plus CIOs, uh, CISOs, and the uh, global uh, analyst community. It really came out that uh, data management in a fragmented world and ransomware protection uh, will become an extremely important theme uh, 12, 24 months from there on. That's I'm talking about 2018. Uh, so what we did is to look out for market solutions who are innovative, who are having the right set of proposition, which is comprehensive uh, and genuinely next gen uh, uh, in, its, in its ability to address this demand. So in that context, uh, our partnership with Cohesity uh, was clearly to bring in a cutting edge proposition, which is comprehensive uh, data management from design uh, to being proactive uh, to manage on an ongoing basis and to be able to recover recover fast uh, in case of uh, a, a disaster recovery event or a business continuity event that comes into play uh, we have created a, a flagship product uh, the enterprise recovery vault right uh, and I'm, I'm so uh, happy to introduce this uh, to the team because it is just not about a particular phase of a recovery process it's the entire life cycle of data management uh, from identifying the critical IP and assets of the organization. So we start with a consulting exercise where we bring in our domain consultants and application consultants to work with the customer organization and identify what are the critical assets that really need to be protected and then creating a strategy of how we are going to have a DR or a third DR or an, a, a, a cold room or a clean room uh, in case you really need a treasury backup to be restored. So designing the solution, implementing the solution, making sure the right skills are there to quickly build and make sure that it is seamlessly integrating with the technologies that's already existing in the customer organizations. So we made sure that this proposition need not rip and replace all that you have got. It can nicely coexist with what you have today, but creating that specialist layer of a ransomware protected clean room so that on a day when something happens, even if your traditional backup had not supported you, this ransomware protected backup solution is there to help you uh, and recover. Doing an ongoing services uh, uh, in, a, in an as a service model. And that's where we have partnered with 
very strong partners like Equinix and SunGuard and Digital Reality and Flexential, who are actually helping us to take it as a service to the market so that the customer need not suddenly invest uh, on a whole lot of capitalized infrastructure or a data center just to make sure this data is uh, protected and saved. They can buy it as a service uh, from Wipro. It's Enterprise Recovery Vault as a service uh, with a combination of uh, Wipro, Cohesity, and other technology partners bringing it as an end-to-end -end portfolio. And on a day when an event happens, we bring in what we call as a special task force. We have created a focused organization which is led by a program management team which is specialist in disaster recovery. So they kick into action uh, if there is an uh, unfortunate ransomware event and they bring in a whole lot of governance, communication channels, business engagement, market engagement, as well as technology recovery to make sure that uh, we still do a, a, a hands-on service to the customer till the business is restored, uh, uh, business as usual as it was prior to the event. I think that really differentiates us as a very comprehensive uh, recovery vault solution from, I would say, like a better word, cradle to grave, if I may call, uh, and maybe come back from the grave and, and continue doing business. <laughs> Relax, you know, and, and you, you, you hit it spot on. I mean, it's not a matter of, first of all, it's not a matter of when, if you're going to get hit by a ransomware attack, it's really a matter of when everybody's getting hit. It's a matter of how quickly can you recover. And that's the question. A lot of a lot of people I speak to say, well, we've got a solution in place. We can protect our data. We can back it up. But it's not a matter of backing up or protecting your data. The, the question of today is no longer, are you meeting your backup windows? Instead, it's more, how quickly can you recover? You know, think of a hospital. You mentioned the healthcare institutions getting hit really rapidly. If a healthcare institution goes down, how much downtime can they tolerate before it really becomes dangerous? From an enterprise perspective, how much downtime can they tolerate before they've got to actually announce it to the market that they've been hit? And these are the kind of things that, that nobody wants to, to deal with. And I think that partnering with Wipro, you know, you've got global expertise in, in driving efficiency, innovation. You've been doing ITOs and other solutions for customers for, for decades, as you mentioned. I think this partnership helps us jointly accelerate this vision. Um, you know, Coezy's platform was born in the cloud era. You know, it, it, we, we uh, were founded in 2013. We came out of stealth and started selling in 2016. Uh, the company's grown rapidly. And now integrating with this partnership, we can, we can align with your consulting strengths, which accelerate our customer's ability to deliver this value and to, to gain this value so that it can be done either as, point, as part of a point engagement, a managed service, or a full ITO. A large uh, conglomerate, um, one of the top uh, uh, 10 uh, global pharmaceutical organizations, uh, where we have been actively engaged uh, in providing uh, IT uh, operational support services. Three years ago, when uh, when we were uh, looking at transformation initiatives, uh, and and we, and we felt that hey, now is an opportune time to look at the next phase of data management uh, and this next phase of data protection, and that's when we took this uh, use case of uh, a ransomware protected backup, uh, not only for their critical ERP solutions, uh, which typically runs on the SAP kind of an uh, ecosystem, but also identifying their core assets, core assets in terms of the R&D infrastructure, uh, which is fragmented, which is distributed across various uh, uh, innovation centers they have got, and how do you really bring all of them well managed under um, a single pane of glass and ensuring that uh, it is covered not only for the primary data protection, but also the secondary data protection, which is taking care, which is, which is covering the, the, um, the, the air gap mechanisms and the clean room mechanisms that's required. So when we architected this solution, we, we looked upon uh, market solutions available uh, at that point in time. We felt Cohesity was very apt in terms of its simplicity, uh, its ease of integration with the larger initiative that customer had from a backup standpoint, as well as the quick time to market that we could get in uh, from the product because it had all the features that we really wanted. It was just a tick box and uh, a quick to get it rolled out uh, and, and with, with fewer integrations with other third-party products. So, so Wipro and Cohesity have taken the solution to the customer. Uh, it's almost 24 months. It's running live now. Um, and every time we do a DR drill, uh, uh, we feel that the solution that we put across 
have really come to use in, in assuring the client time and again, that the data is not only safe, but also quick to be restored uh, in the event that a ransomware event or a, or a malware event really kicks in and, and, the, and the DZ goes down. So it's, it's assuring a continuity, not only from the uh, integrity of data, but also the time that it takes to get back to business. Having seen uh, this giving value for the critical assets, the customer has now expanded that to the enterprise grade uh, portfolio. So the whole uh, backup suite uh, that used to be with various products is now consolidated under Cohesity. And that's really given them a much more simplistic way of, of managing uh, the whole lot of distributed architecture they have got. And just like every other pharmaceutical organizations, they grow through acquisitions. Uh, uh, and, and there's a lot of mergers and diversity that happen in their world. So a product which is easy to scale up, easy to integrate, easy to ramp up uh, was another benefit that they could uh, uh, perceive when they were actually acquiring organizations. We could actually bring down the time to onboard the data of a new organization onto the mainstream from a traditional three month window that they had to almost two week uh, that it takes for us to onboard those workloads. I think that's the uh, uh, big turnaround time that we were able to influence by having more a simplistic solution or solution which can actually coexist and integrate with other products. It's, it's simplicity, it's agility, it's helping customers focus on their business while we manage their most critical asset, which is their data. Let them focus on actually running their business and not having to worry about this. What I've learned from this conversation is if you have the right components in place, you know, for example, the Cohesity platform within a Wipro service protection environment, then you only have to fine tune your data protection approach instead of having to reinvent the wheel to address a whole new threat. Uh, the, the, the solution we've put together with Wipro, uh, the Enterprise Recovery Vault uh, from Wipro powered by Cohesity. I love how that sounds. Uh, an organization can really enjoy end-to-end -end support services and complete resource lifecycle management, now integrated with a ransomware protection solution that's aligned to the NIST guidelines, which I think is something that will allow our customers to sleep well at night.